What's going on guys, Sergeant X Robert here, and welcome back to Dying Light. Crane. Listen, Brecken and a team of runners went after an airdrop last night. He lost the rest of his team to biters and then Ryze's men ambushed him, beat him to a pulp and stole the drop. Now Brecken wants to go after the next drop himself, but we can't let him, and you've got to back me up, okay? For God's sake, you can't even walk straight. We need you alive, you idiot. Okay, we're going in. Act confident. Brecken? Lena? Maybe you can get through to him. Jade, who's your friend? Kyle Crane. Look, Brecken, the last thing we need is for you to go back out there. We can figure out another way without jeopardizing you. Right, Crane? I'll go. I'll do it. Right. Yes. Crane will go. He'll be happy to. Jesus. No offense, friend, but you're as green as grass. You can't just... Crane will manage. He'll start in the right spot. And Lena's right. You need to be here taking care of the towers, convincing them the world's not over yet. Oh, hell. Maybe... One more try before we go to Rice. Yeah. Okay, fine. Good luck, Crane. Jade, a moment. Sure. Head for the cauldron. I'll be in touch shortly. Look, there's something else. We need to discuss. Brecken was hurt pretty bad out there. Worse than he wants people to know. He took a blow to the head. Now he's starting to have seizures, and I don't have any Laura tracks. Yeah, I doubt anyone does. Anti-seizure drugs were being passed out like candy when the infection first started. And the stores ran out weeks ago. Yes, that's right. How do you know that? Look, what do you need me to do, Lena? There's a man in town named Ghazi. He's not altogether there, if you know what I mean. His mother had epilepsy, so he used to pick up medicine for her each month. She died two years ago, but Ghazi kept going to the store to pick up her prescription. He likes his routine, and Ghazi can be very insistent. So, they kept giving it to him. You think he's been stockpiling it all this time? If he hasn't... I don't know where else we're going to get it from. Ghazi lives under the overpass. And don't mention his mother's death. He won't understand. All right. Let's see if I can do this mission. She talks about epilepsy. It's... Hey, do you have spare keys for 202? Well, what's the problem? Something's going on in there. The door's locked from inside. Anyways, speaking of epilepsy, my dad actually has epilepsy. So I would really know when it comes to seizures. The must still have a lot of things in that pawn shop of his. Yeah, probably a bit of everything, really. I sure could use some of that stuff now. Good job out there, 31. Uh I mean, Crane, right? Yep, Crane. All right, um, things are bad, very bad. 
time to go do this side quest. In the rain. Okay. I love this one hit kill stuff. I know it's not gonna stay there forever, but it's worth the shot. Might as well level up. Let's see what I can do while I go for the mission. I like how you can climb on these things. I don't really see the purpose of them though. I, mean, I can easily just climb. I guess I can't kill the zombies in the head no more, one shot. Nope. I guess not. First I need to find a way out of here. Damn. Nope, I think it still works. Just doesn't work as much. safe house over here. Let's see if I can arm him. The more safe houses I can get, the safer I'll be. Whoa! Oh hell no. Nah. I'm not dealing with that today. Get off of me. space. That instantly kills a zombie, I'll take it. Alright. Damn. 
not really sure how I get through. Do I have to go through the tunnel? I guess I do. All these zombies just die in one hit. It's like a new level of heaven right here. Okay. Um. Gazi, are you there? Gazi? Gazi? Is anybody in here? I guess not. It has to be in this house. This one has a light. Wait. Let's say open the door. If mama ain't happy, nobody happy. So you better make mama happy. Gazi? Me too. We have the same name. Are you from the video store? No, my name's Crane. Crane? Crane rhymes with train and brain and sane and grain and rain and plane and the other kind of plane <laughs> and and. But can I come in? No, no, it's impossible, impossible. This is my special day with mom. It's Mother's Day, and it's the most important day of the whole world. Are you from the video store? Oh, God. Why do you keep asking me that? <laughs> keep uh, because asking. you're supposed to bring my movie about me. It's called Charlie. And it's all about me. And how smart I am. Look, Gazi, if I bring you your movie, will you let me come in? Sure. Then you could watch with us. It is Mother's Day. And if Mama ain't happy, nobody happy. Oh, and, and she also wants chocolate. Mama wants chocolate. No, 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 wait a minute. That's too much. Don't argue with Gozi. It doesn't work. That that's what the drugstore people say. <laughs> I can see why they kept giving him his, their prescription. But I remember reading that story, it was Charlie is pretty much just a reference to the flowers for Algeron book and movie. I think I read that in middle school. It was like he went from being stupid to went to an experiment that made him a genius, but started to lose that genius and became stupid again. And when it happened to the rat, the rat actually died from that experiment because it only affected humans and it wouldn't kill him. I guess it was too much for the rat, so... Yeah, it was a nice story for a kid. When you get older, you start to realize these stories are, uh... Lock picking the door. 